That wraps up Cron 4 News at 9. Cron 4 News at 10 is coming up next. Stick with us. And that's your forecast. All right, that's it for today. Bye-bye. Bye-bye. The Cron 4 Morning News is moving. Is there an echo in here? The big morning show move is coming. Yeah, May 22nd from 5 to 11 a.m. Who's up for an extra hour of sleep? Uh, me. We get to hit snooze and go live through 11 a.m. Right, all the news, weather, and traffic to start your day. Let's do this. <laughs> all right. Your Cron 4 Morning News starting at 5 a.m. Weekdays beginning May 22nd on the Bay Area's local news station. Everybody, I'm Grant Lotus, and Bay Area Backroads is back. But this is more than just a trip down memory lane. As we travel with some familiar faces to some unfamiliar places. Welcome to the Chase Center. This time we shoot some hoops at Chase Center and take a scenic ride up Mount Diablo with former warrior and Hall of Famer Chris Mullen. This is Bay Area Backroads. Watch right now on Cron4.com. Bay Area's local news station. You're watching Cron 4 News at 10. Oakland educators have been on strike for seven days. They're on track to enter day eight tomorrow. The Oakland mm -hmm. Education Association and the school district are still bargaining over a new contract. Good evening. Thanks for joining us here on Cron 4 News at 10. I'm Noel Bello. As the strike continues, students, of course, are not receiving a normal education. Cron 4's Amanda Harry spoke to a parent but how this is affecting her child. Amanda. It's clear from the parent I spoke to that the strike has been stressful for everyone involved. She says she feels torn. She wants the teachers to have fair working conditions, but she also wants the kids to have the education they deserve. 